Hey everyone, my name is Nick and today I want to talk about the Pod HD Bass Pack. I've noticed that there aren't a whole lot of videos on YouTube about this bass pack and none of them actually explain exactly what comes with it or exactly what you're getting into when you buy this. So, like pretty much everyone out there right now that has purchased this, I bought this and I really had no clue what I'm getting into but it looked good. But I feel like everyone else should be obligated to know what they're buying before they purchase it. So, this pack comes with three heads and two cabs, as well as a couple of extra mics. And the uh, first head that we have up on our list is the SVT Bright Channel, which is just modeled after an Ampeg SVT head. Pretty basic. And this one sounds pretty bright it's got a little bit of gain on it so it sounds pretty good for your old school thrash metal sound and here's what this one sounds like yeah so it's um one of the heads that I do like on this one a lot, it sounds pretty good. So here's the same riff with the other cab. I actually think this cab sounds a little bit better, in my opinion. You guys might think otherwise. And so the next head up on here is just the SVT normal channel. Same as the bright channel, but it's cleaner. It has um, less gain, and it's a bit boomier in my opinion. And it's good for all styles, really. And here's what this one sounds like. the other cab so that one is definitely my favorite head on here and with my tones, I do use that head mixed. I do use that head and the SVT Bright Channel mixed together. And it sounds pretty good in my opinion. And so the last head on here, it's called the G Cougar, which is actually modeled after a Galleon Kruger. Pretty clever name if you ask me. And this one comes standard with the 410 cab. And this one is probably best for some of your classic rock applications, like some Pink Floyd or something. And uh, here's what this cap, or here's what this setup sounds like. <laughs> And with the other cab.
and the mics we'll just go over them really quick so i think the 47 condenser is one of the new ones that it comes with there's nothing too special about the mics they're mics but you'll be able to dial in your tone more accurately with them I heard the 720 dynamic. I think that's one of the new ones. The 112 I think was already on here, but it might not be, so I'll show you anyway. So that's the uh, the heads, the cabs, and some of the mics, or all of the mics that come with this pack. And so now I guess I'll show you one of my tones that I use. This tone is um, pretty basic. As you can see, I've got the, uh, well, it's, it's pretty basic as in I didn't spend a whole lot of time building it. But I use it for all-around purposes, really any metal recording. I'll just mix it differently depending on what exact genre it is and as you can see i've got two heads on here the svt bright channel and the svt normal channel i use the bright channel as a um, high frequency channel as you can see all this stuff is turned up and the normal channel i use as more of a low frequency channel so you can see the bass is turned up a good amount on this one and uh here's what this here's what this tone sounds like I do have a lot of distortion on this. Well, not really a lot. I've got one distortion pedal. And then that really does it. If I cut off the bright channel. And together again. And now just the normal channel alone. Wait a second. We already heard that. Not just the bright channel alone. Excuse me. And it works pretty well for some much heavier applications, like if you're playing deathcore or death metal or something. Anyway, I hope this video was helpful to you guys. To anyone that's looking to buy this pack and personally i would say that it is very much worth it if you are recording bass for yourself or for your band or whatever and so yeah let me know in the comments below what you think about this video 
I'll probably get a lot of hate because uh, this is one of my first YouTube videos. So yeah, thanks for the feedback if you guys care to drop it. And until next time.